Hey guys, I'm back here with a contest entry for Mr. Tony of the Dead, or as I call him, the Stugats. Now, uh, me and Tony have a great relationship where we go back and forth with swearing at each other and just making uh, stereotypical Italian uh, slurs at each other or whatnot, just in good fun. So if you see those going back and forth, don't get offended. We're just two wise guys having a bunch of fun. But... Uh, the purpose of this video is, first, a valentine for Tony, and second, a uh, guilty pleasure video. Now, I went through my collection. I couldn't really find anything I was really embarrassed about. You know, for a while, I thought about taking out uh, the elderly obese porn that I have, but I decided against that because I didn't want to get flagged. So, um, so I went with the Russ Meyer collection. This is from Arrow Video, I think. Yeah, it is. It's from Arrow Films there, UK. And uh, I first heard about um, Russ Meyer from a radio show that I listened to. Uh, well, they're not together anymore, but the Opie and Anthony show. <clears throat> and they did, they did like a whole day on, or a whole week on how great this guy's movies were. And they would play clips of the sound and... Uh, describe what was happening and, and just having a blast. And it's on YouTube if you want to Google or YouTube Opie and Anthony Mondo Topless. It's like a five-part thing where they're just having a blast listening to these trailers and making fun of them. And I mean, it, I was crying, laughing so hard at, at some of this stuff. The the one I heard they that they d dissected the most was Mondo Topless, which is included in this awesome set here right there and basically what you have in this one is you got a picture it's like in the 1960s that hippie era or free love era and he has a bunch of big chested women uh basically just i can't really even describe you know just flaunting in front of the screen like they're bending over they're posing just you know wearing low-cut dresses or you know, or no clothes at all. And, you know, but he's talking and he has a voice like a carnival, a carnival barker from like the 1940s where he's like saying stuff like why she's like, you know, sh sh shaking her jugs in front of the camera. He's like saying, I dare you to look in her eyes for two minutes while she's, you know, doing this dance. You know, he's just making stuff like saying stuff, funny stuff like that, you know, and then he'll say, you know, I'll ask her a question in that weird voice. Like, it's even hurting my voice trying to do that. You know, I think it's like, hey, honey, you know, what, uh, if you could do anything, what, what would you, you know, what would you do? You know, like a Miss America question. She'll say, oh, I would just like to solve world hunger. And then he'd have like a misogynist remark like, yeah, if you just, you know, uh, shake those boobs in front of, uh, you know, whatever. You know, it's just like you could feed half the world off those jugs. You know, he, he just really bad taste type responses, you know, just but it's it's the funniest thing. And I'm not doing it justice by any means. But, you know, that is that is my uh, guilty pleasure is these type of movies that probably aren't, you know, in the best taste. But um Certainly, you know, they're a lot of fun to watch, at least if you're a guy. And, uh, you know, you have a couple of beers. Maybe if you have a poker night with your friends, you know, throw this on in the background. I, I swear, there's not a better time to be had. So, Tony, I hope this video finds you well. You know, I... Th that uh, You're very generous. You know, you're, you're giving away... I haven't even started saying that. You know, he's get, Tony is giving away... A Wild Eye releasing limited edition VHS of, I think it was, De no, it was a High 8. And uh, yeah, so it, it's like the perfect type of uh, gift for horror lovers and whatnot. So I hope this video finds you well. I hope you're doing well. And uh, I will talk to you soon. Bye.